Hey guys, um, so I just want to show a quick tip. I find this pretty helpful when it, you know, happens, but uh, it doesn't apply to every scenario. It just happens, you know, to apply to this one. So when you're in Revit, you're kind of working, you know, through some stuff and you open up an add-in and the dialog box for the add-in kind of gets thrown off somewhere and you can't open it anywhere. Sometimes this happens because you're, you know, um, plugging and unplugging, you know, monitors and stuff. So it might get thrown off somewhere and you don't know where, you know, it went and you can't click on it. And, uh, and that happened with me just recently where this got thrown off. I didn't want to have to go through closing Revit and then like restarting my computer to get everything like, you know, acting right. So, um, to kind of set this up, I'll move it down here. And what you can do is you can come down here and you can right click on whatever it is and you can maximize it and then that's going to max maximize it to the screen and then up here you can grab it and kind of move it around um you know to to the location you want it so now that you can you know see it and work with it um you know you can uh do that by just just maximizing it so there's also another way um which is this way so you can see now my windows are kind of cas cascaded and uh, to do this you come over here um, or down on your toolbar right click and you can uh, cascade windows so this is kind of nice um, there's also show it stacked so there's a number of ways that you can kind of um, manipulate your your space so that you can have um, or you can get those boxes back back up there so if you know maximize doesn't work because for whatever reason that isn't a thing for that toolbar you can try a cascade window uh, and see if that works um, and hopefully it does but I just wanted to share this tip uh, you know I, I run in I've ran into this uh, a number of times uh, while I was working in Revit and it always sucks because you know sometimes I have to actually close Revit um, so you know just keep this in mind and hopefully it helped you uh, thanks a lot for watching